guys, welcome to the video. So as you've just seen, I've been using a John Deere ride on this morning and that's been really fun. I'm working at a new customer's house and it's quite a big one, right up there with um, one of my favorite places because the garden's in such good condition. Long story short, I've taken over from a chap called Richard Hancocks and he basically, he was running his own garden landscape business and he's kind of decided that he wants to go down the tree surgery route. So he's gone off to work with a tree surgery firm and he's basically given up his business and a lot of his jobs have gone but there was one or two that he's kind of put my way and this was one of them and it's a fantastic place it's so well kept and it's just easy for me to come in and just keep on top of it and maintain it and make it look really nice basically the customer has said i can do some filming here but i won't do too much today because i just want to crack on and make a good first impression you know what it's like a quick pan around of the garden so you can see what it looks like it's, it's just beautiful so they've got the field which I'll be ride on mowing and all the woodland and stuff. And then this is the grass I've cut with the Honda Pro this morning. It looks really good. And it, the garden goes around over there. So it's just a really well kept, well maintained garden. It's beautiful. And I'm really looking forward to looking after these people. It's just honestly such a wonderful place. I'm just about to go and do some more ride on mowing in the field actually. Right, it's the next day. We've got Mr. Premium Bond in the house. Morning, uh, today we are just weeding along here. Look at all this and this, mate, there's loads. So we've been weeding in the gravel, just taking the worst of it out because the grass has all sort of grown this side. Right, we've just arrived at our next job of the day. This is a new customer. So I do a little walk around so you can see the garden and then I'll explain what we're doing. So we come up the drive, which is awesome. Big Al's working on this bed over here, looking nice and tidy. It's such a beautiful little garden, this. This is perfect. I mean, the sort of thing I'd like a hot tub with a sunset, it'd be really nice. Anyway, today I'm working on these edges over here. We're redefining with the half moon. See, I've done the edges with the half moon, just redefined all of those and got to that point there. I just need to clear up all my sort of soil and stuff that i've kind of hooked forward and then i'm going to get my edging shears i could just trim it but i'll use edging shears that properly nice and sharp and get a nice sharp finish for him at some point he has asked he said it's quite mossy and it, just this section of the garden actually most of it is actually quite nice like over there and over there is really cool but this bit here is quite mossy and it is because of that tree when it's in full leaf it's quite shady here so this is something that I'm gonna treat. I'm gonna scarify this little bit and then I'm gonna sort of seed and feed it for him. And I may even quickly get the strimmer and go around the tufty bits, because I think they cut it last week, but I may even get the Atesia on it just to give that its first run. Because since I've had the mower, I've not had any opportunities to test it yet. I've had it two days, but I haven't used it yet. So I'm excited to mow with it and see what it's like.
little fun with that. It's easier. Right, we're done here. Let's have a quick walk around. So Big Al's been working on the beds over here. They're looking nice and tidy. We've strimmed all the edges all the way around the path as well. Strimmed all of this. Giving it a quick mow with the Atesia, as you've just seen. I've shaped up all the squares. There's more around there, which I haven't done, but I've done these ones, so they look cool. Giving this lawn a quick cut. All the edges have been redefined and shaped up all the way around, so that's really cool. We did through here and mowed this little bit as well. So yeah, for a first visit, I think we've done really good. Shaped up those edges too and under here. So yeah, really good. Good job done, mate. It's a nice garden, isn't it? It's beautiful. Really, really nice. Over the coming weeks, we'll be doing some weeding and stuff in here, just basically all the way around, but the garden's immaculate. It's probably one of the easiest new gardens we've taken on. Right, so we've got another one to go and do. I might have to go and buy some two-stroke oil because I don't know what I've got. I think I've only got a little bit left. We haven't got none at all. We haven't, so we're going to have to go to the mower place and get some stuff now. Yeah. Last job of the day, and I'll get this in quickly because it's very windy and you probably haven't been able to hear much of what I've been saying today, but this is what I'm doing. Me and Buggy Out are going to be doing some weeding in the gravel, weeding in the beds, and basically weeding all along the top of that brick wall and all the weeds in the gravel here so this is our last job of the day to get this lot all nice and tidy amazing how much is coming out of here that's all weeds and leaves and muck and sticks from literally just from that section there around here mad isn't it how's your legs is it your knees put it this way i feel every one of my 67 years <laughs> every one of them so this is the last bit we've got left to finish off just that bit there and just a few weeds on the stones here and I'm just literally about to pull these bits of grass out which are in the middle but otherwise I say it's generally looking good now so um anyway with a click of our fingers we'll have this done and there we go all done so we weeded all this bed we weeded all the gravel we did all of that cleared all the leaves we did all the way around here all the way along the top and um, we weeded along there and had a good blow around. Now my knees are that good. <laughs> <laughs> I also did a little bit of strimming for the customer because he does like all the mowing here. So occasionally we do a bit of mowing for him, but he mainly does the mowing, I do the strimming sort of thing. But yeah, anyway, that is us done for the day. Yeah, I have been in and got changed. I just had to pop out in the van. So I thought I'd take this opportunity to just end the video. Yeah, really good day. Big Al was a legend today. Always a legend. You know, we always get so much done. Like, literally, he is a game changer for me. Yeah, really awesome to get as much done as we could. Had so much fun. You know, the first job there that you sort of start the video with the John Deere ride on, that was a new customer. It's quite a big garden. Really, really enjoy working for them. Super nice people. They've got a brand new Honda Pro there as well, which they let me use. So I'm super grateful that they've got two decent mowers that I can use, which is, you know, fantastic. And second job in today's video, uh, actually it wasn't second job because that was weeding, wasn't it? But the, yeah, the, um, the, the third job there where I was using the Atesia 
what a mower that is, the Atesia. You know, I've only used it today and it wasn't that wet to be fair, it was quite dry. The whole reason I bought that mower is just so that I can use it in wet conditions. So I'm gonna do like a proper review video with the Atesia, but I need to do it on a day when it's a little bit more soggy. And do you know what? It's been wet for weeks on end and the day that I actually use it, the sun comes out, you can't make it up, but I ain't gonna complain because a little bit of sunshine would do everyone the world of good and raise everyone's spirits, wouldn't it? So yeah, wrapping up the video here, if you're new to the channel and you haven't been here before, it would be really cool if you could smash that subscribe button, it really helps the channel grow. Um, if you like the video, give it a big fat thumbs up and if you've got any comments, get them in below and I will reply to absolutely everyone who takes the time to drop a comment in below. Hey, listen, thanks guys, hope you've all had a really good day. The weather does seem to be turning, it's looking like it's going to be a drier week which is really good for everybody. <laughs> keep them fingers crossed and keep working hard. So I'll see you guys in the next one, see you later, have a good rest of the week, take care. Peace out.